Winston Churchill once said, attitude is a little thing that makes a big difference. No one exemplifies that saying more than Perry's Wesley Godfrey. The senior is hearing impaired, but that hasn't held him back one bit, excelling in cross country, basketball, and track. This week's OIO Prep Profile highlights Wes's outstanding work ethic and inspiring positivity. I, I got married child. I lost my hearing at s seven months old. I was just a baby. And then um, I've been a hair pair since two, two years old. Of course, I was involved with deaf culture and sign language. At the age of two, Godfrey got a cochlear implant, so he doesn't rely solely on sign language. I mean, there's a lot of people around, it's hard to hear, but when it's quiet like this, it's easy to hear. To pick up the sounds and the different tones, the communication, and you have to talk a lot, do a lot of spirit thinking. While some might get discouraged by a hearing disability, Wes has taken the opposite approach. Let's do your whole block for me. He's made it a positive in his life, and he's made it uh, he actually works harder because of his disability and and I just think he is who he is because of his disability. If I know I can do it, I can do it. I, I never seen myself, oh I can't do it, I'm deaf, no, no, I, I just know I can do it. Let me do it. Every night at practice uh, he's our hardest worker and he's always encouraging everyone else. Uh, he's a leader, he's captain of our team. Godfrey's high school career has been full of memorable moments, like helping the basketball team claim its first ever district title last winter. Wes also holds school records in the 800 and 1600 on the track, and now in his senior season, he's running in the 400, 800, 4 by 200 relay, and 4 by 800 relay. It's very focused, like you have to focus. And like, if you're on 4 by 4 or 4 by 2, you have a team that depends on you, and then they want you to do your best. So if you do your best, that's all you can do. When you get Wes on the track, he's 100% all the time. So he's automatically in fifth gear right away, bam, as hard as he can go. And at the end of every practice, he will go by and shake the hand of every assistant coach I have, and then, of course, my hand. But every night since seventh grade, he's shaking our hands to end the practice and thanked us. Wes's athletic accomplishments are impressive, but it's the way he carries himself off the field that has made him an inspiration. Just a young man of integrity, follows the Bible. Hey, we know Formula One. Doesn't miss church and is just a great role model. I want to be working in construction is that um, I've, I've been talking to a lot of people, so I've been, so it helps me to move and like with me making friends with other people, Hearing people um, helps me make it easier. A lot of coaches are role models for their players. He's my role model. <laughs> He's a role model for me. He makes me want to be a better person. He wants me to be a better coach, a better Christian. He, he's the, the, the type of a kid that you only get once in a lifetime, and uh, I'm glad that I've had the last five years to spend with him. With the Commodores, I'm Matt Finkel for the Sports Report.